I grew up here in this valley and really enjoyed being outside. And one of the reasons I, I went into education, I think, is just that natural, that curiosity about how things work. And it came from spending so much time outside. Being in education right now and for the last 20 years, um, somebody asked me, no, I, you know, I'm, I'm too old to get uh, a layoff notice from the school district. I'm too young to retire. So I guess the challenge that we have now, first of all, the opportunity that we have, and I want to thank uh, Paul and Rob and the whole Land Trust staff and board and Rick especially for giving us this opportunity for having this piece because it is a tremendous opportunity to get students out here and encourage that that curiosity for, for the land. And I feel as an educator that's um, a responsibility that we have to our children to get them out here, um, out from behind a computer screen or a TV or Game Boy or even cell phone and get them out here to be curious about the land. And it's, it's gonna take a while. Rob came to me five, six years ago I'm not sure. I was at that point teaching somewhere else with this plan for an outdoor classroom around every school. And I said, it's a great idea, Rob. And now how do we take all this standard stuff that comes from the state down the line to educators? How do we work that together and get kids outside and, and, and make that mesh? And that's still now that we have the land and the opportunity that's still, you know, a bit of a, a bit of a challenge, but we're going to work on it. Yesterday, I brought my earth science classes out here, all three of them, and did a little bit of cleanup and pulled some invasive weeds, and it's just a start. And I look forward to the next, uh, however many years I'm going to teach still, um, to bringing those kids out here more often, to incorporating this land into their learning, so they see it as as one. Not as, not as kind of separate things, we're either in the classroom or we're outside, but so that whenever they're outside, they have that curiosity and they want to learn. And I mean, lifelong learners, that's what we want to help create. And I think having this place so close to school, um, this beautiful land that we live in and helping them understand how, how special it is, that's, uh, that's our challenge, that's our opportunity, and that's our responsibility. So. I look forward to that, and I thank all of you guys for coming out here and, and sharing in this dedication ceremony. And thanks, Rob, Paul, Land Trust Board, and all the donors and volunteers, and Rick for making this happen. So I'm going to thank you. Thank you.